Hello YouTubers, I hope you are doing fantastic. I'm doing great. Um, getting ready to head out to the gym um, because I think I'm just going to be out and about this weekend because it is just absolutely gorgeous out here in Southern California. It's that weather that you think of when you think of sunny California. It's that beach weather, that hiking weather, that picnic weather, driving up the coast weather, anything you could possibly be thinking of doing outside, that's the weather we have right now. So um, I got a good one for you. And, uh, you know, before I get into it, though, I want to just let you guys know some of the stuff I've been listening to this week. I've been listening to uh, Louis Armstrong. Just love that guy. And uh, also uh, Cowboy Junkies. Um, those are the two that I've mainly been listening to this week. Um, but let's get into this. I, I, I'm always out and about. I found some, some CD scores along with a few other things that I'm going to share with you. But for starters, we are going to get into the CDs. So, first up, man, I was so happy to come across this one. It is Crystal Lewis Holiday. And for those of you that don't know who Crystal Lewis is, she was a gospel singer. And um, I, I have some gospel stuff. I have probably a nice little collection of it. And um, she's one of my favorites, if not the favorite uh, female gospel singer, but she no longer does gospel. I think she just does jazz. Um, but I did listen to this this week, actually, uh, in June, Christmas in June. Um, and it is just such a great uh, Christmas CD, man. I just can't wait to play it on the regular when Christmas comes around. But I'm going to pump the brakes and make the me the best of this summer that we ha we're going to have here in California. Um, next up. Uh, Louis Armstrong and so man I just love Louis Armstrong and um, you know I have some of his Christmas stuff and I was really happy to come across this CD and just so you guys know I spent uh, everything I'm gonna show you today I spent 20 bucks on and that's just not the CDs and you guys are just gonna be blown away when you see everything I got for $20 next up Cowboy junkies and man I, I i discovered these guys in the 80s i think i saw them on saturday night live and i went out and bought their album uh the very next day unfortunately i don't i don't have that album anymore from the 80s but i do have cds and um you know you guys might know them as from um uh, misguided angel um sweet jane uh, Common Disaster. Those are some of their bigger hits, and I think that they've even appeared in like some movies, you know, some soundtrack uh, use of those songs. But anyhow, Cowboy Junkies. Next up, Fog Hat and uh, Fog Hat Live, and um, you know, it's all the stuff you you would love from Fog Hat. Fool for the City, Home in My Hand, Just Want to Make Love to You, uh, the big one, Slow Ride. Fog Hat Live, guys. Pretty good stuff so far, right? Next up, um, Michael Jackson, uh, Bad. And so, um, yeah, this is a cool CD. I, I'm pretty sure I already have it. But uh, for the prices out there, man, I just took it. And uh, Michael Jackson. Okay, I was really happy to come across this one. Um and this is uh, Bruce Springsteen, The River. And that's like a two CD set. And uh, man, I was really surprised to see this out there because, um, you know, other than like Born in the USA, you don't really see a lot of Bruce Springsteen stuff out there. So happy to get that one. Next up, um, The Essential Michael Jackson. And this is a limited edition. And it's pretty cool. It has uh, three discs. Let me make sure I'm not lying to you guys. Three discs. And so, um, yeah, I was really happy to get this one. And um, I see a sleeve. No, it's three discs. I saw a, a section for a fourth disc, but I think that's just the way the, uh, the sleeve was made. But I love these cardboard uh, sleeves. 
because they they kind of remind me of a miniature album or you know vinyl record so anyhow uh michael jackson and um what do you think i got next you guessed it <laughs> michael jackson uh number ones and so i'm pretty sure i have this one too but you know what uh I'll probably just pass them on to my son. Um, anyhow, this is just all the number ones of Michael Jackson. Um, Rock With You, Billy Jean, Beat It. Uh, you guys all know the, the drill on Michael Jackson, right? Okay, next up. I was real happy to find this one. Um, Billy Joel, She's Got Away. And... Um, and this one is uh, a collection of rare recordings, and I haven't given it a listen yet. Um, but, you know, I, I know most of Billy Joel's stuff, but uh, can't wait to pop this one in and enjoy it. Next up, Garth Brooks. You know what? I don't do a lot of country, but I do enjoy Garth Brooks, man. I've, I've just always... Uh, uh, Doug on Garth Brooks. Uh, the Dance is probably my favorite uh, Garth Brooks song. And so there we go. Garth Brooks. Next up. I also like this gal. And she probably falls under the country uh, category too. Um, and I love her gospel stuff too. It's, it's really good. Um, Carrie Underwood, Carnival Ride. And um, there you have it. Carrie Underwood from American Idol. All right, let's see. We've got a couple more good ones for you guys, and then we'll move on to some of the other cool finds. Um, you know, let's, let's get into those finds before. Um, so I came across a pair of Sharp 150-watt three-way speakers for 10 bucks, And, um, yeah, I got it from this at this yard sale. And uh, the guy, it was the end of the day, the guy just wanted to get rid of them. I took them for 10 bucks, cleaned them up a little bit. One of the grills need to be, the cloth need to be glued at the end. I did that as soon as I got home, posted them, sold them the very next morning for 150 bucks. Not bad, right? 10 bucks to 150 bucks. The only bad part about it, because they were incredible sounding speakers, and I'm going to post a picture for you guys, um, is that... I didn't get a chance to use them um, for my videos. So um, anyhow, you're just going to have to do with the picture. And, you know, uh, that's that. So next up, what I got here was uh, the same guy gave me two of these with, with half of those CDs. So I didn't pay for all the CDs I'm, I'm showing you. Um, he gave me these things. And these things sell for like 40 bucks on... on um, eBay so I don't know anyhow he gave me two of them I'm probably gonna sell them um, you know I, I have uh, one back here you can see the top of it um, I don't know that I like it though I, I might just sell all three of them and just keep the movie thing going there just because I like the way it flows um, but if you notice back here guys I have these are all like music uh, DVDs and it's concert stuff it's music video um, it's movies. You can see the doors there by uh, Jim uh, with Jim Morrison. And uh, let's see. Well, of course, I got the wall there. I got Ray, Purple Rain. And I'm thinking about doing a, a, um, a video on these music movies. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. Um, also, if I didn't mention it before, let me know what you guys are listening to. Um, because I did get some cool tips, uh, uh, some cool recommendations on the last uh, um, video that I put out. So I would greatly appreciate it. But anyhow, I got these things too. So with the speakers and the CDs, I spent 20 bucks. Uh, let me know how you guys think I did. I think I did great, man. Just CDs are awesome. Um, I got another video coming up for you too of some awesome receiver scores that I got. Anyhow, let's get back into the, uh, the CDs and finish this up here. Next up, Marvin Gaye Super Hits. So, Sexual Healing, uh, Sanctified Lady, 
I live for you, um, walking in the rain, stranger in my life, Marvin Gaye. Who doesn't love Marvin Gaye? Well, I love Marvin Gaye. Okay, so last but not least of the, the actual music CDs is um, Forever Gold, Santana Live. And so I was really happy to come across this one. I love listening to live CDs. Um, I don't know what you guys think about it. You know, let me know in the comments how you feel about it or if there's a cool uh, favorite uh, live CD that you like. Uh, let me know. Uh, my first uh, exposure to live music was Kiss Alive. Remember that? Um, back in the 70s. Anyhow, um, Santana Live. It's a, it's a cool CD cover uh, with a picture of Carlos Santana there. Um, last thing I got, which I thought was really cool and most and probably very important if you're going to be uh, playing CDs, was a CD cleaner. And um, yeah, so I got all this 12 CDs plus a, uh, a cleaner. These two um, storage cases or boxes or shelves, whatever you want to call them, and a badass set of speakers that I sold all for 20 bucks. Let me know what you guys think. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you so much. Um, if you dig the content, please like and subscribe. Um, I just dig uh, doing this for you guys. And have a blessed, awesome weekend. How do I always leave you? God bless you.